We're underway in round one of the BWHA Division One competition for 2020, brought to you by Joan P's MP, Bart Mallish MP. It's between Ascot and Saints. Well, not sure what was wrong then. Anyway, we're going to go a second go. Trap, straight shot, good save by Brown. And umpire says, free hit to Ascot and Ella Brown. Shows just how good a keeper she is. This is why she's playing Div 1. Not a great stop up the top of the circle, but the shot got away. It was dipping. Ella Brown managed to get in front of the ball and clear the ball. Did a great job. Play. Back stick pass into the circle. Gleeson saves it, but Dutta gets the rebound, puts it past Gleeson into the back of the net. That's the first goal. Oh, this is good work from Dutta. Gleeson didn't have to make the save. This is a back stick pass. She makes a save, didn't need to do that. Dutta swoops. And that's a good goal. Good reactive goal by Dutta. An error by the keeper. And Saints pay the price. As a goalkeeper, you can be the number two keeper and never get a game. It happened to Maddie Smith. It happened to Grace O'Hanlon. And it occurs because as a keeper like in Jane Gleeson's place, it was Audrey Smith who was in goals for Queensland. Oh, another shot and off target again by Laney Smith. And Ascot again doing well, taking it in the side, having a player unmarked in front of the goal. The shot's off target. Watch this. It's good work. That's Laney Smith. No, it's not Laney Smith. It's one of the other players. Laney Smith draws the keeper to one side, player in front, but the shot's wide. Again, the single battery set up much better injection this time. Straight shot. Good save by Gleeson. Bread and butter save. And the free hit goes to Saints. And they'll bring it out quickly. And you'll see Jane Gleeson. You've got to do more than this to get it past Jane Gleeson. She's straight down. Blocks a shot. Gets it forward to her defenders. This time, Angie Lambert. Well known for variations. Not this time. Not a great injection. Jane Gleeson makes a good save. It was a bobbly shot. Laney Smith still has it. Tops the shot that time. Umpire says play on. And now another penalty corner for a stick check inside the circle. So you watch this. Jane Gleeson, this is a bobbly shot. And she manages to get her pads together. Clears. But Laney Smith on that far side. She came in after making the injection. And again, Renee Holmes can't get the big size 11s out of the way. This time to Laney Smith. Laney Smith, straight shot. Another good save from Gleeson. Because it was high and dangerous off the rebound, off the pads, it's another penalty corner. Girls, we've had one variation. It was a good one. But the injection's quite slow. We need a fast injection. That's much better. Good trap. There's the variation and the shot. But that's wide of the target. Ella Brown, untroubled. So watch this time. This is a good injection this time. Nice variation for the setup for the second shot. Eliminates the runners, but the shot's wide. So you watch this. The runners are eliminated by the variation. But that shot has to be on target. Far side. That's Turner. Turner's going to get it into the circle pretty easily. Ashton's waiting for it. A shot at goal. And umpire Warner says it went over the baseline before the shot. So if you look at this carefully, you'll see it go over the baseline. And the umpire, she was about to blow the whistle before the shot was taken. And she'll show, if you have a look at this, Turner takes it over the baseline. There it goes. It's over the baseline before the shot was taken. That's why it's no goal. And it's a good one. Straight shot. Good save by Ella Brown. Bread and butter save. She had it all lined up. And it's a long corner. So this is quite a simple penalty corner. It's just a straight shot. Ella Brown had it all lined up. 
We're about to get away. A little variation change this time. Right hand side. Agnew. Across to... No, it's the side of the net. It looked like it went in. It was our first shot anyway, so it was high. And that's a free hit. So a variation this time didn't really work very well. The injection was off target. It enabled the runners to come out, and that shot's wide anyway. So not a very well-worked penalty corner by Ascot. So very disappointing for Ascot. And straight shot. And Ella Brown gets that left kicker out and easily makes a save. So another simple corner. It's executed reasonably well. Ella Brown up to the task. Handle to it. Seconds remaining. I think it's nearly over. There's the full-time siren. It's all over, Red Rover. And Ascot have taken out this round one match against St Andrews. One goal to nil.